Hello friends. Today we are going to read Silkworm. The authors are Claire Verbeek, Tembani Glarla and Zanel Butalesi. The illustrator is Kathy Feek and the publisher is African Storybook dot org. So let's read silkworm. What is a silkworm? A silkworm is a type of insect like a moth. It makes silk. How does a moth make silk? Let's see. The worms laid small eggs on the leaves. So a silkworm is a type of insect that lays eggs like other insects do. And these eggs are on the leaves. What leaves are these? Let's see. We fed them mulberry leaves. Mulberry is a type of fruit, a berry like raspberry and silkworms like eating mulberry leaves. And so the worms lay their eggs on these leaves and you can see these little eggs here. When these eggs hatch and the little babies come out, they eat these leaves. They grew bigger and became fatter. So here you can see that the baby silkworm has come out of its egg and it, it, it has eaten the mulberry leaves and it's become bigger and fatter. What is this? What are these things here? It looks like some sort of thread, doesn't it? What do you think it is? Let's see. The larvae made silk cocoons. So a larvae, a larva is one and a larvae is the word for many larva. And so this is what the larva looks like. You can see it looks a little like a worm. And what is it? It is the small, the baby form of a moth. You may have seen some of these out on some trees and leaves. Even butterflies, moths, they also have the same kind of little ones. So the kids, the larva, the larvae makes silk cocoons. What are cocoons? Cocoons are a little wrapping around the baby. So how does that work? When the little silkworm is born, it's small. It's a larva form. And so it eats the leaves. You can see it eating the leaves here and it is getting bigger, but it is not a moth yet. Moth has wings, right? And it has legs. It's, it doesn't look like it. And so what, what does it do when it's growing from that small worm to this big moth? It has to protect itself. It has to hide and grow big. And to do that, it weaves a cocoon around itself. It weaves a cover. And you might have seen this also. It looks white in color. It looks like a little uh, wrapped package and it, it, it's called a cocoon. And so this cocoon is made by the larvae out of silk thread. Inside the cocoons, the worms turned into pupae. So 
you can see here, this is what the cocoon looks like. And it is made out of silk thread. And inside this, what is there? It is the larva, the worm. And the worm is getting bigger. It's growing up. It is turning into pupae. Pupa is one and pupae is many. And the worms are turning into pupae. They are growing legs. They are becoming bigger. They are growing wings inside this protective covering. Some people breed silkworms for a certain purpose. So in this picture, you can see that the silkworm has come out of its cocoon and it has become big. See, it has wings, it has a bigger body and it has all the different parts. It is now a fully grown silkworm moth. And some people breed these silkworms. They grow them for a certain purpose, for a reason. What do you think that is for the silk? In China, they keep thousands of kinds of silkworms. So China is where silkworms grow a lot and they keep thousands of kinds of silkworms. You can see here, there are all these trays. Each tray has mulberry leaves in it and some silkworm larvae. And what is going on here? They are growing these silkworms here in these trays. And what? why do they do this? To take the silk from the cocoon. See, you can see here she is extracting the silk. They make silk cloths using their cocoons. So if you remember, the cocoon, the protective cover, is made out of silk thread. And you can take that thread and make it into silk cloth. And that's what they do to make silk cloth. Thank you. The difficult words in this story are silkworm, the worm of a type of moth that makes silk thread, mulberry, a type of fruit, silkworms eat the leaves of this plant, larva, plural larvae, an insect after it hatches and before it changes into its adult form. Cocoon A covering or case made by some insects to protect themselves or their young ones as they grow. Pupa Plural Pupae A stage of growing for insects between larva and adult. Breed, to grow an animal from birth to adult. Moth, an insect that looks like a butterfly. It is less colorful and with a thicker body. This picture is of a silkworm moth. Try these questions. Write down the different stages of growth for a silkworm from egg to adult. Have you seen a larva or a cocoon for any insect like a butterfly? What did it look like?